right, in this video, we're going to be taking a look at an individual integral. We're going to take a look at the integral of a to the x over x squared minus bx dx. All right, so the first thing that I'm going to want to do is I'm going to want to factor out an x here on the bottom so that I can cross out some x's. So I'm going to algebraically manipulate this integral to start with. So I'll have an ax that is going to stay in the top. I'm going to factor out the x in the bottom, which will give me then an x minus a b. All right, and then dx. So algebra manipulation on the original function that allows me to then cross out those x's. So they're going to be gone. All right, now keeping in mind that a and b are constants, they're going to be numbers. That means I can pull that a out in front. So I'm going to have the integral with the a pulled out in front. I'll have a one over an x minus b dx. All right, now at this point, I want to go to a u substitution, and I'm going to let my u be that bottom denominator. So I'm going to let my u equal x minus b. I'm going to go ahead and take the derivative of both sides. So I'll have a du is equal to derivative of x will be 1. This is a constant. It's going to fall out, so I'll just have a dx on this side. So then I'm going to come back up here to the original problem, and I'm going to start doing some substitutions. The a is already out in front. Okay, the one's going to stay put. I'm going to replace the x minus b with a u. I'm going to replace the dx with the du. I am now in terms of u, so I can integrate here. We all should have memorized at this point that the integral of 1 over u is going to be natural log absolute value of u. So we'll have a natural log absolute value of u, and then plus c because I've integrated. Last step then would be to replace my u. So I'll have a natural log absolute value x minus b, and then plus c. So basically a straightforward u substitution. All right, the only initial step then you need to do there is a little bit of algebra to manipulate the equation so that the u substitution works nice. Definitely thanks for watching. If the videos are helping, please share with your friends so they can benefit too. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks.